at ShaneStars with DroidMotorX.com. Today I'm going to be showing you guys the Buzz Launcher. If you're one of these people that loves to change the look and feel of your home screen on a regular basis, this is the app for you. This just makes it very easy to find a new look and feel for your device. Uh, you can change your home screen based on home screens that others have uploaded. There's over 300 home screens to choose from with new ones being uploaded on a daily basis. So you can see this is the launcher setup that it comes with. You want to go ahead and download the Buzz Launcher as well as the Buzz Widgets. I'll include links to those in the description. But basically what this does is it takes and provides you with the home screen that someone else has uploaded and it shows you all the applications that you need in order to achieve that look and feel. And if you don't have the applications installed on your phone, it links you directly to the place in the market where you can get those so that you can achieve that look and feel. So we'll go to the hot category here. And we'll choose a new theme. You see that you can find any type of design here from, uh, you know, different movies. There's some Windows designs in here. Yesterday I saw some Ubuntu style designs in here. There's an Ubuntu. And as you can see, the options are just about limitless. This reminds me of Me UE Theme Chooser. There's so many to choose from. So I found this Iron Man home screen. So we'll go with, you have two to choose from here. If you scroll down, it'll show you all the applications that you need installed to achieve the look and feel. There's 32 to choose from here. Now the ones that I don't have are highlighted like so. But if I need those to achieve the look and feel, those will automatically, it'll show me where to download those if I need them. So we'll go ahead and download this home screen. And we'll apply to home. You can either apply to the home that will replace your current home screen or you can add to your home, which just gives you an additional home screen. So we'll go ahead and apply to home. It takes just a few seconds to download and install. Now we'll go ahead and select OK. If you already have the widgets downloaded, you can simply enable them. Like so, that gives us our battery. Our time and date. And then we can add different apps or widgets to the home screen as well, like so. And you can easily delete those. You can add a folder or an action. Can add an app drawer there. And then, if you wanted to be able to return to Home Pack Buzz, you would need to add that icon if it's not there already. This way, you can return and choose a different Home Pack. If we go into the particular home pack, you guys can see that we can share or like it. And then we can also have a conversation with the uploader of the home pack. So if there's something that you would like to see added to the home pack, you could let them know. So that's a pretty neat feature there as well. It's kind of like a community inside of this application. So guys, that has been the Buzz Launcher. I hope you've enjoyed this review. Be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.